Welcome back. Thank you for staying with us on KTN Prime. Now, despite yesterday's deal between the national government and the governors on the increment of 32 billion shillings to the revenue due to the counties in the next financial year, the governors are now saying that their Pesta Machinani campaign is still on course. Here's Zubeda Kome with more. The 2015-2016 budget allocation of 258 billion shillings for counties is apparently still too little for the governors supporting the Pesa Mashinani campaign. I think we have agreed uh, generally that uh, Pesa Mashinani will be put on hold. Even after Wednesday's deal, in the presence of Deputy President William Ruto, so counties get 32 billion shillings more, the governors insist the campaign is still on. The campaign is on and so far we have collected over 1.2 million signatures. Uh, that was not a subject of this meeting. Yes, it was not discussed. <laughs> the governors now claim that it is not all about the county allocation, but making sure that the allocation is constitutionally guaranteed. A bill prepared by the Council of Governors suggests that counties should have roles in land management. The bill further suggests that forests, forest lands, water catchment areas and natural parks be managed by both governments. We have issues like uh, land matters, which at the moment is a big issue and we believe counties must have a role in the management of land in a much more significant manner. The Council of Governors Chair Isaac Ruto says that if the bill does not pass into law, it shall proceed to the referendum. The intrigue surrounding the Pesa Mashinani campaign could take a new twist when the governors elect a new chair later this year. Zubeda Komekitian Prime.